I think that's like some kind of um, like a jellyfish and there's a huge spider sitting there so I gotta be really careful. It looks like somebody tried to get into this Toys R Us at some point. I don't know what, what wow. Dang. Look at this. It's crazy, man. Why would you want to break in the Toys R Us? Ooh, whoa. Oh, I kind of feel like I need to get out of here. Nothing happened. It's just a weird white truck right here and it doesn't seem like anybody's in it. I'm not afraid they're going to do anything. It's just... I don't know what they're doing, but if you don't see me after this video, that truck might have something to do with it. Yo, peace and love guys. We are back with another video. Today's special unboxing comes from Leaves. He's a guy that reached out to me. He really, really wanted to work with me. I told him you gotta send me something I've been looking for for a long time, and he did. So today we have the Yeezy Boost 750. I believe this to be the first Adidas Yeezy um, they ever made. So I always wanted a pair, and this is when shoes started to get nearly impossible to grab. I thought I was gonna get a pair, never did. And now I do, so let's go ahead and jump into this and see what these look like. Got a bunch of paper right there. A couple dust bags for the shoes. Those are the dimensions of the box. Let's go ahead and take them out. Let's see what we got. And I like this foamy eggshell type of uh, carton thing they got in there. That's a nice, it's a nice touch. It's good for storage. I'll probably keep this box for these because it's such a, a big sneaker. So here they are. I've never seen any of the 750s quote unquote authentic ever. So this is the first time I'm holding one, observing one for myself. And from first sight, I'm going to say they look amazing. If you guys have seen these before when they release, please drop it down in the comments. Let me know if you notice anything. But I think they're amazing. So shout the leaves for actually digging in and, and sending these to me. I think they're quite expensive to kind of get this big old box sent to me and probably to, to source them out. So shout out to him for doing that. So just looking at these, the suede and the shape of these, it, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. And shout out to Minor Kicks. He he got a black pair from someone. And I was like, man, no one will ever send me these. And then here goes Leaves. He got me a pair. So shout out to Leaves. Shout out to Minor. So looking at Flight Club's little description here, they say the Yeezy Boost 750 chocolate sneaker was released following the Yeezy Season 2 presentation at New York Fashion Week in 2016. The design combines a light brown nubuck upper with an elastic midfoot strap, perforated vamp, in a gum boost midsole that glows in the dark. The sneaker also features an upgraded ankle zipper. So, I mean, the zipper seemed great to me and I didn't know that these were the ones that are supposed to glow in the dark. Um, when we were in the live, you guys told me they didn't. Some said they did, so I don't know. And when I tested them on that live, they did not glow in the dark. So anybody watching this that knows if these glow in the dark or not, I didn't do any research to see if they really did. Just let me know. But if you just look at the craftsmanship with these, these are made extremely well, extremely well. Like this is like the best looking suede I've seen on a sneaker my whole entire time getting gifted sneakers. Like the entire shoe, it does look like an UGG. Like I see where the, I see where they got that from, but it's just so well played. Now the boost here, it didn't come up hot purple or it didn't, there was no red flags when I looked it up under the black light and it just feels like typical boost. Nothing still feels like a 350 type boost, but you can still feel it. It's squishy, but not like, you know, overly squishy. But I love the color. I think the overall color of the shoe is on, but I'm not sure about the midsole. There's the insoles, nothing fancy. There's a little spot on the bottom from the inside here. You can see some of the boost coming through this insole here. It's a size 10. You can see the date on there it says 716. So I think they got that right. It says they upgraded the zipper. Now the zipper worked. It didn't get caught on anything. It, it just went up and down, no problems at all. So shout out to you for finding a good pair. Like to me, if the sole is off, that's okay. Because it does look a little it does look a little orangey to me. And I ain't gonna lie, it would have been cool if it if it did glow, but you know. You know, maybe you can see me those next time leaves. Who knows? Man, man, man. This this is just out of control. How do I keep doing this? And my battery's dead, man. Uh, uh, uh. 
Oh well, I guess I'll just have to do without it. Yo, peace and love, guys. I'm gonna be um, doing some scouting, I guess. I've been invited to go to this um, little show. It's a performance, like a concert. Club Tilt and Grill. Um, be some good people there, got some great performers there. I don't know what this is gonna look like. I've never really done something like this professionally, but I definitely appreciate the opportunity from Lovely Rebel. Um, I hate using my phone like this too, but you gotta do what we gotta do. I do got the Yeezys on. I'm gonna have to go home and change. I don't know what I'm gonna wear, probably something very videographer-ish. Am I covering up the camera? Yo, peace and love guys. I'm in the back of an alleyway by a trash can. It's like a little show, I'm not asked to work. Yeah, I'm here. So I'm gonna go do some on feet. We're gonna see how this goes. I'm just gonna pretty much go from that. I, don't, I really don't know what to expect, so let's just see what happens. It's pretty dark back here too. I probably shouldn't be back here. Hi guys. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. Make sure you come back for the next video, guys. But well, I hope you have a great time tonight. Without no further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and start the show.